You're watching City Line. Now, if you have a dedicated DIYer in your life, but you are not one yourself, <laughs> you may be wondering what the perfect gift would be. Well, Leanne is back with her go-to list of stocking stuffers for those who prefer to do it themselves. And you are the essential DIYer. So let's talk first about what you have for the painters out there. Well, I think now's the perfect time of year to be thinking about the New Year's projects that so many of us have on the list. And if you know someone and are buying for someone who is a weekend warrior and willing to get their hands dirty around the house, mm -hmm. little stocking stuffers, they're those little gadgets that maybe people wouldn't buy for themselves. But let me tell you, some of these small gadgets are life savers, time savers, money savers okay. to help you get through your project. So let's nice. start with painting okay. and specifically paintbrush and roller storage. Mm -hmm. So if anyone's like me, which I'm sure you are, you start a project and think it's a day one project and yeah. it ends up being a three, four, five day project. Like my laundry. Which is right? Yes. The laundry. Yes. Well, I don't have a solution for laundry, but I have a solution for storing your paint rollers <laughs> okay. and paint brushes. And that is a paint roller and there's a paintbrush cover. So with this, if you finish painting for the day, you didn't quite get everything done, instead of wrapping your roller in a plastic bag, which I've done, and I've also had the logo of that bag transfer and get all over the ink all over my roller, so I had to throw it out and start again. Instead, you've got this little guy, and what I love about it is they've been very smart. There's a hole on the end there that allows you to keep the oh, cage nice. on to store this overnight. Very good. So that you can start fresh the next day, yeah, right? Yeah, very good. Very smart. So I mentioned same thing with the paint brush. And again, that. has a nice seal on the top, the foam, and this will keep a really great seal. This isn't something you're gonna store for months at a time, right. but overnight a couple days to get you through the project, perfect. We'll keep your paintbrush nice and fresh. Ooh, I love that. Okay, what else we got? So, this is one of those things, I've shown this on the, the show many times, and every time I show it, I am flooded with DMs of, what is that? Because I never, I don't often explicitly show it right. as its own. Mm -hmm. I show it as a tool to help with my DIY projects. Okay. So this is called the Comfort Grip, and it attaches to your spray cans, and instead of now having that sore paint-covered finger or thumb when you're yeah. spraying, allows you to control with the trigger and get that perfect Ooh. spray seamless finish. It's almost like airbrushing your paint yes. with the trigger. Really, you get the consistency with no drips, right? Because nice. you get drips when it's, when it's your finger. That's right. So the Comfort Grip, again, super affordable, perfect to tuck in your stocking stuffer. Well, we know what LA wants for Christmas, right? Listen, give me all of it. All of it. I love it. Santa, I've been a good girl. Yes, she okay, has. Okay, so I want to show you this that I just picked up. Okay. This is one of those gadgets that I was like, gosh, why didn't I think of this? One of my biggest annoyances is getting out a paint can, you pour the paint and then it's dripping everywhere and it's a mess and yeah. it's running down the side. This little guy fits right on top. So you have the spout, it'll seal up the paint really well, so yeah. it's easy to pour. But here's the thing that I was like, boom, so brilliant. You can store your paint can and stack all your paint cans afterwards as Brilliant. well. So keeps your workspace nice and clean, yes. which is great. One little silicone thing and it makes such a huge difference. Honestly, right? right? Uh, these I'm going to show quickly. Yep. These uh, I, are my very own. I wanted to bring in my own for my, for my workshop to show you that, yes, I do use these. And if you're wondering, what the heck are those? They're little paint pyramids. Okay. And why would you use those? Well, when you're painting something, you can raise it up especially if you're spray painting or using a brush so that when all the paint kind of drips off the bottom, it doesn't stick to your yes. surface when it's dry. You raise it up and you get a nice clean edge on the bottom. Smart. So the paint pyramids are awesome, but I want to show you this. Yes. I was surfing around on Amazon mm -hmm. and came across this. It's a paint touch-up pen, but I was sold on the name. Slob proof. <laughs> you had me at slob proof. Right. This is, I haven't tried this. I'm, I'm very excited to give this a try, but I think it's brilliant. Okay. It's a little syringe. Mm -hmm. You take a little bit of paint from your paint can. Yeah. You put the lid on, you store this away. Yeah. And next time, if you have a little ding or scratch on your wall that you need touched up, you don't have to get out the whole paint can and a brush. Yeah. This works as a paint marker. Oh. A little marker to touch up your wall. So smart. Think about all the things that get nicked that you it's just need dings. to little color it in. Right? Oh, that is so the smart. The little touch up. So those are all perfect small little goodies that go right into the stocking. Let's talk tools. Let's talk tools. Okay. What you got? Again, all the little bits and bobs. Yeah. This. Anything with the word super in the name yes. has sold me. And this is the super socket. <laughs> super socket. So instead of having a toolbox full of all the little bits and bobs yeah. to fit all of the different types of Allen key heads, mm -hmm. screwdriver bits, this 
is if you can see, if the camera can see, it's little springy bits in there. Oh, so it doesn't matter what shape. So it will take on the shape of anything that you need to tighten. So for example, different sizes nice. of kind of the Allen key wrench tops, even yeah. a hook, Ooh. it'll transform to whatever the shape and size is. So this replaces all of those little bits that would be in your yes. toolkit otherwise. Oh, excellent. Very smart. Another smart gadget, yes. this guy. This is a little piece of fashion. This really could double for Fashion <laughs> for Friday, weight. right? This is a magnetic wristband. Okay. Because how many times have we been up the ladder yeah. and you need four screws to screw in that hook for your curtain rod, yeah. but you end up doing this, <laughs> which is super unsafe. Don't yeah. ever do this because you don't want to choke or they fall down. This. Yeah is magnetic. Oh, so it will smart. hold all of the screws. You can have all of your different bits there as well. Yeah. So that when you're up the ladder, you don't have to go up and down the ladder so to change your bits and get all of the accoutrement that you need to finish your DIY project. I would throw a chocolate chip cookie in there. Right. And I would use it for safety pins. Well, that's exactly that's what, what I have all over the house. Safety chocolate pins. Chip chocolate chip cookie. You read my you mind. You have a snack, you got the bit, mm -hmm. whatever you need. Do all the things. So I good. like how you DIY. Right? You know what else I like? What? I really like something that is so simple, yes. yet so smart, okay. and gets me jazzed. And hopefully I'm not the only one jazzed about this, because then that would be really sad. <laughs> uh, this is the what most is it, LA? simple, wee little thing. <laughs> it is, at first glance, a little measuring tape. Okay. It's got a center point, so it starts at zero and goes out on both sides, but it's adhesive. So Ooh. this, again, comes in a really cute little container, so great for the stocking. Yes. This is something that I would stick on my workbench so that I can just, I don't have to pull up my measuring tape, I can lay down a piece of wood and mark oh. my wood, or even better, yeah. I can put this on my fence of my saw, mm -hmm. and now just lay the wood down and set up my, I don't have to pull, again, pull up my measuring tape ever. Yes. So smart. Last Beautiful. but not least, yes. This little cute thing. It's a little oh, it's snowflake. a cute snowflake. No, it's, it's 18 tools in one. What? It's 18. There are little Allen key wrenches on there. There's little yeah. screwdriver bits, and there's even a bottle opener. So that's a perfect oh my little gosh. right in the stocking. On Travel a keychain. with that. Right. That is very smart. So smart. Great ideas, uh, LA. She always brings the best stuff. And if any of these look like perfect stocking stuffers for your friends or family, make it easy on yourself and just shop the show. Just scan the QR code on your screen right now to be taken to shoppable links for all of these products, or you can visit cityline.tv. Well done, LA. Thank you.